Welcome to Five Nights at the Krusty Krab here in Rose Car Let's Play. Uh, Five Nights at Freddy's Clone. I've actually seen this around the internet, and since I do absolutely love Five Nights at Freddy's, and I'd like to go ahead and continue with that game series here soon, I thought I'd do something just a little out of the ordinary. Now, I also love SpongeBob SquarePants, although I haven't really watched the show past the fourth season, because in my opinion, the, um, the seasons that follow the fourth one have just gotten sillier and more ridiculous. I mean, and I know the show is silly and ridiculous, but it, it's, you get what I'm trying to say. It hasn't really been good to me since the fourth season. So with that in mind, we're just going to dive into this because it looks like it's going to be hell of fun. So here we go. Night one. Well, that's not too bad for... Uh, hello? Oh. Uh, hello, hello? Oh, hey. Welcome to your new job at the brand new Krusty Krab restaurant. Uh, so, I'm the manager of this store, and I've been given a list of instructions to help you get settled into your new and exciting career with us. We're very glad to Ooh, have you on board. Damn. Here. So, uh, first off, welcome to the new Krusty Krab. Uh, you may be familiar with some of the older restaurants in the chain, notably the original store as well as the Krusty Krab 2. Uh, but this is a brand new store, and as you can tell, in a brand new location. Uh, as you already know, I am the manager here, uh, appointed by Mr. Krabs himself, to be honest. Uh, and I've selected you as the night watchman here. That means it's your job to watch over the place, as well as the other employees for me. Interesting. Uh, oh yeah. I should probably let you know, uh, instead of me hiring a brand new crew, uh, Mr. Krabs simply staffed the kitchen here with animatronic replicas of his old employees and neighbors. Krabs isn't known to be the most trusting person, especially with his money and secret <laughs> recipe. No shit. So, I guess it does make a bit of sense. Anyway, speaking of valuables, they're located in a safe behind you, so it's your job to lock down the office in case you see any intruders. You can do this by closing the blast doors on either side of the room. Just bear in mind that at night, you switch over to a backup generator with a limited supply of power. Closing those blast doors, as well as using any other electrical equipment, will increase the strain on that generator. No if shit. If you use too much, the restaurant will go dark and you'll be completely vulnerable. Uh, one last thing, if you notice any electrical equipment acting up, like uh, lights flickering or something, uh, the most likely cause is the animatronics. Uh, they've been designed to draw power from an outside source to save on their own energy costs. So, if you notice the office lights flashing, then it, it probably just means they've wandered up onto the landing out the front of you. I wouldn't worry too much about it. What? Anyway, that's enough for me. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Good luck and have a good night. Yeah, thanks a lot. Um, that's a scary looking squid word right there. And, um, yeah. Oh, okay. That's cool. So, yeah, I love Five Nights at Freddy's, and oh, there's Mr. Krabs right there, or the animatronic. Oh, there's Patrick. Hey, Patrick, how's it going, buddy? Okay. I think that's Sandy Cheeks. Yeah. Okay. Wow, this is really weird. <laughs> um. So, usually... So I recall the first nights of these games, it's actually the easiest kind of just um, get warmed up into this into the game. It doesn't do too much to, to freak you out. We'll say I'm a little tense right here. Yeah, conserve my power just a little bit. see too much here but um I'm 3 a.m. nice it's 3 a.m. I must be lonely at the Krusty Krab Krusty Krab pizza is the pizza you know I was wondering what a Krusty Krab pizza would taste like just checking all the lights and all that stuff okay Let's see yeah, there's a Krusty Krab right there seen Squidward around. Probably my famous last words. 
Hold over here. Nope, I don't see him. So, I'm just gonna make sure that. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna be that stupid about it. Well, there's Patrick. Still don't see Squidward anywhere. anywhere. There's Pat. Ooh, that's a scary looking Patrick. Ugh. Hey, what's that? Nope, oh, I can't see. Oh, shit. No, come on. What about over here? I'm just gonna just leave that down. Oh, there's SpongeBob hanging out with uh, Mr. Krabs. That's cool. You guys just finding out how to keep Plankton away from getting the secret recipe? Well, that's good. Good idea. All right. Anything? Anything? No? Ooh, that music gets intense. Don't see a square word around. Keep that down. I mean, it's 5 a.m. So, I'll just fucking do this. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna weasel my way out of this. <laughs> my nose has been itching here, but yeah. And I don't see Squidward. I'm at 5 a.m., so... I'll just chillax here for a little bit. And I think what I'm gonna do is split this game up into each night as its own episode. Because, you know... Really like to know what you guys think. If I should really continue on things like this. Hmm. Hmm. Really nothing. Yeah, it's thirty-five percent of my powers left. I mean, there's really nothing going on. It's five a.m. Shift is nearly over. So, yeah. There we go. 6 a.m. I did it. <laughs> yeah, I totally ripped that off from Five Nights at Freddy's. So that was night one. And figured to give it a game, a bit of a chance. As you can see, I just breezed through the first night. Because, well, why not? Because <laughs> when you play games like this, the first night is always the easiest. Then as the game progresses with each subsequent night, it gets harder and harder. But this is where you come in. Do you want to see another episode of Five Nights at Krusty Crab? I almost said Five Nights at <laughs> You want to see another episode of Five Nights at the Krusty Crab? Hey, leave a comment down below. Give me a thumbs up and tell me you want to see more. On the next episode of Rose Car Let's Play, another awesome video to get you through today. So, until you hear from me again... I'll see you on the flip side.